Closing market comments for Tuesday, April the 13th. Markets opened about unchanged last night, slightly higher, and then rallied from there selling before selling off late in the session today. December 21 corn made a new high this morning at 5.05 and three quarters. At the close, old corn was up 11, new corn up eight, soybeans up seven on the old, up one on new, and both old and new crop wheat were up two cents. USDA released their weekly crop progress and conditions report last night. Corn planting was up to 4% compared to 2% the previous week, 3% last year and 3% average. Indiana was 2%, Ohio 2%, Illinois was 5%, Michigan 1%, Iowa 1% with Minnesota, South Dakota and Wisconsin not reporting. Spring wheat was 11% planted up from 3% last week, 5% last year and 6% on the average. Winter wheat conditions were rated 53% good to excellent, unchanged from last week and down from 62% last year. Indiana was up one at 70%, Ohio up four at 81% good, Illinois down one at 73, Michigan up three at 72, and Wisconsin up 6% at 75%. The western states on the hard red winter wheat still remember, remain well below normal, and Minnesota, North Dakota, and uh, South Dakota uh, are not reporting much at this time. North Dakota, Minnesota, and Montana all received one to three inches of snow last night with calling up to nine inches in places. This is welcome as it has been extremely dry in the drought conditions. They're glad to get some moisture. Ukraine and Russia are having issues with Russia putting forces on the border next to Ukraine and telling the U.S. to stay out of the area. Dr. Cardania lowered his Argentina bean crop 1 million metric ton to 45.0, but he left Brazil unchanged at 133. China's first quarter bean imports were up 19% over last year. The question is, will it continue with African swine fever coming back in? Brazil's center and northern parts of the Safrina corn crop are getting good rainfall, but the south remains extremely dry. The dollar today was down 314 points at 91.83. Gold was up 1260 and silver was up 533 points. Crude oil was higher again today. Uh, large imports to China were announced. Uh, crude traded up 71 cents at 6041. Stocks closed the day mixed with Dow futures down 60, NASDAQ up 160, and S&P up 12. Okay, thanks for watching. Have a good day.